All right. Good evening, say friends. You made a man coming at you again from Walk Studio. I'm back here in Studio B. And uh, mind you, I'm coming from a different camera this time. Coming from an Android at a different aspect. That's how I come you got this wide view of me. Uh, we just want to say we thank God for our grace and mercy. And we thank him for as well as it is. And thank you for all of you. I just wanted to come back, in other words, just to say a few more words off. To let y'all know that regardless of what, Middle Man is always thankful and grateful. I am very thankful and grateful to our Heavenly Father for allowing things to be as well as it is, has been this year. Uh, we are down now at the very end of 2020. We know we have had some trying times this year. I mean, me myself, I've been in the hospital twice this year. Uh, matter of fact, but we still want to say that we are thankful and we are grateful for the Lord has allowed us to be still standing. We're still in the land of the living. And I wanted to make notice of something. I know everybody won't be able to say this, but I can. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give God the praise and thank him for it, that I can say it. I want to say to everybody, y'all, even throughout this pandemic, matter of fact, all of my church families, uh, New Salem, uh, Antioch, my home church, Missionary Baptist Church, uh, Pleasant Grove, AME Church. I want to say something about the three churches, as well as the choir member that the Lord has allowed me to be over, to, 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 to stand tall over them as their minister of music all these years. I've been with New Salem 15, been with Pleasant Grove about 27. I've been with Danny Yawk all my life, just about it, in other words. Letting y'all know, but I've not always been the musician there. My buddy was the musician there a lot of years before I was uh, Mr. Floyd Carter, y'all. I'm just letting y'all know that that's my buddy. That's the one that taught me a lot. Him and Daryl both, uh, they're both buddies of mine, and uh, the keyboard players to, to the max, and some singing guys, too. But what I want to be let y'all know that I'm thankful and grateful for is the fact that out of all the pandemic, I have not lost one church member or choir member to the COVID-19. And that's a blessing, y'all. That is something to be thankful for. As far as I know, I have not lost one church member or choir member that I am gainfully employed right now. I have not lost one of them. They are still kicking along with me out of all this stuff that's been going on. And we just saying, God, we are, we are, we are grateful, y'all. We are, we, are, we are very grateful for that. And I, I know everybody cannot say that. I wish they could. We have lost some people that we love. Yes, I did. Because I did lose two former choir members that I had, uh, Sister Rose, Williams and Bertha Williams, those were two of my former choir members from uh, the Mount Calvary Missionary Baptist Church. And I did, I did lose them to the pandemic. But like I said, they were former choir members. But I'm talking about one that I am gainfully employed in and right now that I am hooked up with. New Salem, Pleasant Grove and me in my home church. We have not lost one person to the pandemic. We have not lost one, and I have not lost any choir members as well. So that's something to be thankful and grateful for people because everybody cannot say that. Now, I can't say that I have lost others, like I just told you, that I loved and was close to, and we miss them as well. And we wish we could have, we wish things would have been different with that, but we that's out of our hand, y'all. We we don't have no way of having any control over that. But we can say that we still thank God for the one that he did spare. And he left us here for a reason. And so that's how come I'm saying, y'all, whatever part that we got to play in this thing, we need to play it real and be real with it because God allowed us to be here for a reason. So let us go ahead on and chalk it up and just going to do what we need to be doing. Let's not find a way to be complaining and belly aching and finding fault. And that people that's always going to find fault. 
Some people are always going to find fault. Well, you know, I, I feel sorry for those. But a middle man is going to find a way to give thanks. Now, I know things, it's got some things going on with me. Everything's not going on with me the way or great that I would like to put it to be. There's some things that are not going good for me either, but I'm not going to complain about it. I'm just going to be grateful for the things that God has allowed to go well with me. And we're going to take it on from there. And we're going to take this attitude into 2021. If the Lord allowed us to call us over to 2021, I don't believe he brought us this far to not let us cross over. So I just want to say to y'all, be great and be thankful for where as well as it is. And let us stop all the belly aching and complaining and fault finding and, and, and just utterly we up one minute and down one minute. We just we just we just won't give God the, the grace to give him the give him the glory that he deserves. Let us just do that much, y'all. And I think we'll be all right. I just want to come back. I thank y'all for this here time. Thank you for your time that you give me on this camera. That you allow me to do these videos. Some of you don't mind it, robbery, that I will do the video. I know a lot of people may not see the video. But nevertheless, I thank the what God for the ones that do. And the ones that do give me feedback on them. We praise God for you. And we thank you. And we are praying that you will cross over into 2021. That's middle man prayer for you and for everyone on this here Sunday night. That being said, it's middle man saying whatever you get, whatever you get into. If God's not in it, come out of it. Because it's going to come to nothing. Until the next video, next Bible study, whichever comes first. This is Middle Man saying peace and good night.